So, uh, doing the sermon introduction this morning, um, we did some math and it actually will be 15 weeks of doing church this way. But the good news is this, uh, that we are reopening. Uh, Cindy, do you want to take a sec just to show people some of the preparation that is going on right now and just even panning the chairs. You can see the setup's going to be a little different, folks. And by the way, obviously you can appreciate we're not done setting up yet. I'm setting up the chairs. Don't move them. We're wanting to have all of the protocols in place so that social distancing can be accomplished and we can open safely and according to the guidelines that have been provided for us uh, that we need to stick to. Um, you know, it's funny because here we are 15 weeks later and we thought, you know what, go right back to the start. I'm here with my little friend and we didn't get it fixed. Still broke right back to the start. You know, that idea of going right to the start is what John had in his gospel. We've been going through the series on the domesticated Jesus. And one of the things that, that we can do when we make Jesus less than he is, is we can make him small. And that's ironic because the, the gospel writers were wanting to show Jesus as he is and they couldn't help but make him big. John's gospel is, is one that did that really, really well. And he accomplished that, I believe, so powerfully with the first few words of his gospel. He took his readers right back to the start because he started his gospel, that, that word that had been uh, inspired and given to him by God with these words. John chapter one, verse one. In the beginning was the word, and the word was with God, and the word was God. He, meaning Jesus, was with God in the beginning. John chose those words for a reason. Genesis starts with in the beginning. And John said, if we're going to present Jesus right, if we're going to present him well, as he needs to be seen, we need to go to the beginning because that's where we find him. He wanted his readers and he wants us even today to know that Jesus is no small uh, token person of history. He's God. He was with God in the beginning. He was God right from the start. As we look ahead to this last Sunday of church at home, we're going to look at Jesus. All of the wonder of how big he is and why it's so dangerous to make him small. God bless you. Looking forward to this Sunday. Looking really forward to July 5th. See you soon.